Be my people. I live in a truly international city. I live in Melbourne, of course. It's got the biggest Greek population in the world. It's also got a very fast growing Indian demographic. So I did the Indian vodka last year, last week. Not last year, it hasn't been that big, not a big a week. So this week, the extra is going to, I'm going to be doing a Greek vodka. Romeo's Greek vodka, to be precise. I got it from Mum um, Stephen at Gerard's Imports. It set me back about $45. And yes, the other half and I have set back a fair bit of this stuff. We were drinking it ice cold with a good set of water. Nice big ice blocks, um, ice cold soda water and this stuff. And you can see how much is not left in this bottle. And no, I've been completely miserly. I haven't shared it. almost any of my friends. I think they got trying to put the wrong, wrong, wrong lid on my um, bottle, aren't I? That's the reason why I wouldn't fit. <sighs> there are days when I disappoint myself and that, that times are challenging to go do. So, there was no sound of happiness because it's a screw top. The smell of happiness says, to be honest with you, it's a very smooth brandy. Very, very smooth brandy. It is proof. And I will check that. Yep, it's um, 40%. Most of the writing is in German. Um, and my German is, mm, let's just say I'm not about my, at my children enough to get a produce uh, thing. It says it's from the Peloponnes, which is, um, I believe where ancient Sparta was parked. Okay, so bad history lesson aside. Oh, very smooth. I get lots of caramel and that on the nose. Um, yeah, lots of caramel, lots of cinnamon. I believe I've just hit vanilla over the toast. So it's quite spicy as a vanilla. I mean, sorry, as a brandy. Um, I say we the other half and I knocking it back with um, soda water I really wouldn't go doing this with anything all that challenging as a, as a mixer because you're simply going to lose what is a very drinkable spirit um, and like I said this is about $45 I got it for so it's not very drinkable it's also incredibly cheap um, yeah there's not a lot to say it's spicy it's 40% so it's giving me a nice glow. Um, I would not go mixing it with anything terribly complicated like an orange. It wouldn't make a, a fizz, um, more likely make a lethal brandy sour, um, which is something I'll have to test drive. Gonna uh, harvest the lemons off my, my tree. But apart from that, yeah, perfectly, you know, have a large one of the large glass like this, 50-50, ice, you, you, you have um, soda water, this baby, and whatever ALG is going to run away because we all know that alcohol is um, a sterilizing agent and a medicine. So, thank you very much for Stephen um, from Gerard's Imports who um, supplied me this. It's not a freebie. I gotta state this I paid for this baby. Um, I'm currently researching the one that he did give me, which is actually a um, Grappa or Rakin. I don't know. I don't read Greek. It's as simple as that. Yeah, but, uh, what a failure of me. <clears throat> but you should go and get some. I will include the address, um, contact details um, in the write-up to your imports. Don't know about the website all that well. But thank you, my people. Hit that subscribe and, and follow buttons. And I will catch you around.